Welcome to the Great Exodus series, God's plan of rescue for his children. Let my people go, the path to Mount Zion. My name is Michael, I'm the founder of Triple Grace and the Righteous Pass Movement Foundation. And today I have a very fascinating topic for you. Jesus is coming. Yes, we all have seen the Mercury transit passing the sun. And Mercury is a messenger representing Gabriel, the angel Gabriel who came to Mary to announce her that she will give birth to the man-child. This is a pattern to the Revelation 12 sign. So now we, were, we got the message. It was announced to us that the man-child will be born. But how? How will Jesus come? And when will Jesus come? Is it not said that Elijah will come first? Yes, he will come first. But we, now we are not talking about months or years or whatever before. Now everything will be done in days. On the 11th was the Mercury transit, the announcement covered by the sun of the messenger that the virgin, Revelation 12 sign, will now give birth to the man-child, which is Jesus. We will see tomorrow on the 17th Elijah is coming. Of course, you have to understand, this is not physical, but this is spiritual. God has given to many messengers, he said, this first coming of my, for the escape of my bride, it will not be physical, but it will be spiritual. So you people start to pray as you have never prayed before. Pray day and night to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ because he is coming as a white rider. The first seal will be broken and he will come forth and he will come to collect his bride. Now, will there be other pattern fulfilled? Yes, the 40-day pattern will be fulfilled. So let's put it in chronological order. On the 11th, 11th, we had the Mercury Transit announcement of the messenger that something great will happen. On the 17th, we will see Elijah's spirit is coming as a forerunner for Jesus. And on the 21st of this month, our bulwark, our fortress, our hope is coming in the spirit. And the spirit of Jesus will remain for 40 days on earth until the 31st of December 2019. There might be an escape of the children and of the vulnerable and of all this one who are totally innocent right at the coming of the Spirit of Jesus on the 21st or around that time period. But Jesus will be then for 40 days, his Spirit will then for 40 days roaming on earth and collecting his bride together. All the people that are already written for long in the book of life the people that have made it, that are without spot and wrinkle, he will visit them and he will tell them, now my son or my daughter, your time has come. And when the 40 days are over and he has collected his bread, then on the 31st, the main escape of the bride will take place. And by the 1st of January, the tomb will be empty. This is of course also a pattern again, as it was Jesus go to ascension, all the people will also go and then will be going to the third heaven. So praise the Lord, praise God Almighty. Jesus' spirit is coming. He has shown us so many signs and wonders right now. This is the timing. Because in January, we will see the second seal be opened and war will start. So by the end of December, everything is fulfilled then there will be people remaining here because not everybody will take part of the bride and these people will then receive the holy spirit after 10 days they have to wait for 10 days more to the 10th of january 2020 and then they will receive the holy spirit and the holy spirit will empower them now to be the harvest workers for the sealed tribulation period so if you are selected to be a harvest worker and to remain, do not worry. Then you will go in the, 
in the true rapture of the church at the sixth seal. I know the date about it, but I will not announce it right now. And then you will be taken to paradise. You will not be the bride, but you will be the people, part of the people who will be invited to the wedding feast. And a part of this group that will bring in the harvest during the seal tribulation will then also be part of the 144,000 who will work doing trumpets. So there are people who belong to the bride but will remain. And then there are people who belong to the rapture but will remain. And then they will all be together with the 144,000 later on Mount Zion. So you can be part, you can be going through all of this. Even if you have a spot and wrinkle, you can volunteer to remain and be part of the harvest workers, or guide the harvest workers, become an elder in the movement for the harvest. But now, rejoice, rejoice people. But it's the last time, repent now. Elijah's spirit is coming and then Jesus' spirit is coming. For 40 days now, your last chance if you want to be the bride. Repent, repent, the kingdom is at hand. Repent, people. Change your life. Come out of the world and out of Babylon and walk that path. Jesus is coming right now. Pray as you have never prayed before. All the time say, Maranatha, come Lord Jesus, come. Because he is coming close to you. And if you are with the right heart, because he will come and look in your heart with the right heart. He will come to you and he will tell you, it's your time, my son or my daughter. You will go with me into third heaven. I'm calling my bride. This is the time. Now, do not forget he is coming from the 21st of November to the 31st of December. This is a time where you should put everything into prayer, into worship, into repentance, into coming out change no sin come out of sin come out of your career thinking come out of your drinking of your smoking of whatever you have stay holy jesus is coming jesus is coming right now if that is not exciting then what will be praise the lord praise jesus praise god the father that he sent his only begotten son now to come not in the physical but in the spiritual his spirit will be there the first seal will be broken, the white rider, Jesus Christ's spirit will come and he will gather his bride and will take it to the third heaven. And you can be part of it. Pray as you have never prayed before. Go down on your knees. If necessary, lay flat on the floor and give your life and everything over to Jesus because Jesus is coming right now. Please, I beg you, pray. Repent, change your life, come out of the world. Now fully concentrate on the Lord and the heavenly kingdom. Make yourself clean, because our God is holy, and so we should be holy. Thank you that you have listened to this topic today. And I hope you take it to your heart and repent and change your life and pray as never before. I pray that all the people who listen to me, that all my brothers and sisters will be worthy, accounted worthy to escape all these things and be part of the bride and will be taken to the third heaven by the 31st of December 2019. Come Lord Jesus, come Maranatha and see you again tomorrow. Have a blessed day.